just not cute. I, I'm really not fucking with this. I'm really not. Yes. My hair looks so old, but... Okay, hi guys. <laughs> I feel so weird. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name's Chelsea, and for today's video... Y'all already saw the title. I'm just gonna be talking my crap while I do my hair. I'm taking it out. It's been on for like two months, two and a half months. For some that may be too little, for some that may be too much. For me, it's too much. Like, especially with this type of like braiding material, yarn. No. <laughs> no. So, um, I'm just gonna talk while I do my hair. I don't know how these videos go, but it's, it's basically like my other videos, like get ready with me, except I'm getting unready, so let's get into it. So, what I'm gonna do is, I have this trash bag, you know, for the hair that I'm taking out, scissors, rat tail comb, and a big, you know, with them African combs. Once, like, I get enough hair that I can actually comb it out. I'm not the type of girl that takes out their braids and wait until they're done and then they start combing because that's just too much. My hair is already matted. It's already nappy. I got no time to be going back in section and, like, combing it out. I'm going to go as I go, if y'all understand. Am I the only one that feels so, like, bad whenever they take out their hair? Like, even though it's already, like, old and grown out, Y'all finna see ugly faces I'm finna make. But it's okay, because we close like that, you know? Like, we homies. But I feel bad whenever I take out my hair. Because it's like, that's somebody's hard work. You know, it's like somebody's hard-earned money. Somebody's hard work, like, you know, time. Lately, I've been going to school with, like, a bandana because... My hair is so grown out that with the other type of hair, you can kind of hide it. But with the yarn, like, you can you can tell. This is my real hair, and this is the yarn. So, it was not cute. And she needed to go because I have my, um, I have my grad pictures that I have to take. So, I needed to look cute, like. I'm finna be cute and that's some period. I mean, not really. I saw other people's dresses and however they were dressing, they were wearing dresses. A sis picked out a suit. <laughs> so, it's a green suit. I'm f I think I'll do a video and maybe post it, but it's a green suit with like a white tank top with like floral, not floral, it's like, I don't know how to explain it. Maybe y'all finna see it once I post the video. But yeah, I'm excited to take this hair out and see my growth. Like, yo, I'm the type of person. Okay, I've been natural for two years, two and a half years. And in those two years, I never got my hair braided. But before that, I used to get my hair braided a lot. Plus, I had, I had relaxed hair, so I never really knew my curl pattern. But anyway, um... I'm the type of person, I started to realize that I'm the type of person that's like, once they get their braids in, 12 hours later, they gotta take it out to see if their hair grew. Like, I don't know if y'all relate, but once I got this hair, I was like, ooh, I look good, but I really wanna take it out to see if my hair grew. Like, in 12 hours, sis, it did not grow. But I really hope that it grew. And what do y'all think about me making hair videos? You know, becoming, you know, stereotypical black girl on YouTube. If she ain't doing makeup, she doing hair. Most of the time, black girl, black girls do hair on here. So should I become a hair YouTuber? Cause I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. Should I? But I feel I'm. I'm not gonna be taking videos in my shower though. <laughs> that is not me. Mm -mm. First of all, my mama would kill me. Second of all, no. <laughs> There's already enough creeps out here. I'm good, love. I'm good. Like, I don't want to make this video so long because I know I can talk for hours. And I don't want to be editing this video for a long time. 
So, oh my god, she cute. I wish y'all could. Wait, <laughs> I'm wearing something under here. But, yo, it used to be right on my. It's literally the same thing. Except it's in a stretched, um, stretched state. Y'all see this? Wait, I don't think y'all can see that. Y'all see that? Nasty. But I did wash it. I washed it three times. I washed it three times. So, I, some of y'all may be thinking, ooh, that's nasty. Especially if you're not a black woman or a black person in general, you might be thinking, that's gross. Wash your hair every day. Baby, with 4C hair, with nappy hair, you don't wash your hair every day. It's a no. It's a no. It's not good for your hair. Even with straight hair, you're not supposed to wash your hair every day. It's not good for you. I got some olive oil. Yo, this is gonna take me forever. Yo, bro, this is gonna take me forever. I really thought that since these braids are kind of big that it was gonna go by fast but nah yo now that I actually got kinky hair it takes faster than relaxed hair because relaxed hair your hair is already kind of straight you know so you can just you know comb it out but with this curly and already matted yo basically a whole dread a whole lock we don't say dread out here we don't we don't but wait let me turn down the brightness but this is my length <laughs> wow she kind of long or whatever oop she kind of long or whatever you can't see it with this black thing but she cute she cute but yeah it took me a whole four minutes to do this. This is gonna be a long time. And what time is it? I just, it's five, it's five o'clock. We'll see what time I finish. Okay, so I asked my Snapchat. I don't know if I should tell y'all what my Snap is. Cause like, first of all, I only have like, what? 345 subs, 345 subs. So it's like, it's not that deep, but um, Anyway, I asked people on my snap, like, most of them are, like, my friends, they know me, or, like, some of them are just added random, they added me randomly, so I, like, follow back or whatever, but, um, I asked them, y'all, can y'all help me, um, can y'all send me topics or whatever you want me to talk about in my next video, and only one person responded, <sighs> so whoever you are. You're the real MVP. You're the real one. I freaking appreciate you so much. Because, like, first of all, I don't even have a lot of people on my staff. <laughs> That's the thing. Like, but, um, I'm pretty, it's over 100. That's, that's the thing. It's over 100. But, these people, y'all saw my snap for a whole 24 hours that I didn't say some trifling. Anyway, so one person was like, oh, you should talk about yourself. Like, let us know more about you. And I was like, me? For what? Like, I don't really be doing too much, yo. I'm braiding the one that I already did, so, like, it doesn't mix with the other one. But anyway, they were like, oh, talk about you. Let us know about you, Chelsea. And I'm like, ooh, me? My life ain't really that interesting, like, I'm not that interesting, I don't really do much, I already told y'all I have no social life whatsoever, but, but, um, what's it called, y'all know how there is like a few black girls at my school, and one of the black girl. She, I was on Twitter, right? And she... I, I was on Twitter and I commented down a thread. And I guess she happened to see my name. Because, like... Okay, so I commented down a thread. And it was like there's two different threads that I commented down. It's This is not even important, but I'm just saying. Um, I commented down two different threads. And 
the first time I commented down in one thread, I didn't have my picture, like my face or whatever, so you couldn't tell it was me, was like a Kanye meme. And and then I was like, I just had a thought. I was like, let me just change it to my real face, you know? Like, I look cute, let me show y'all how I look. Cause I was getting like numbers on that. Like, I was, it's like at 800 or 900 favorites right now. So I was like, I right, let me just change my face, you know? So I did, and then I commented down on another thread. That one didn't get as much likes. I think it's like 200 likes right now. And she happened to see that one, and she was like, girl, what? How come I just saw you on this thread? And she followed me, and I was like, I was like, I, I then went to DM her, because she like replied to my tweet, because she saw me. I then went to DM her and I was like, yo, this is wild. Because I feel like, I low-key felt like it was, um, it was like a sign from God. Because like, oh, child. Because like, I was like, yo, God. I was like, bro, can you please help me out? Like, I got no friends. Like, I'm trying to make friends. Like, I'm trying to become their friends. So, because I always see them, they seem cool or whatever. So, yeah, and I was like, bro, I feel like this is a, this is a sign or something. Like, I always see you. Wait, I don't even remember what I said, because it was like a midnight. But I just said along the lines, this is a sign, this is crazy, yo, this is wild. Like, what are the chances? And she's like, yo, what are the chances? Like, that just means we're on the same side of Twitter, which is, you know, black Twitter. And I was like, yeah, that is crazy. And then we just started chatting or whatever. We talked about school or whatever. And she was like, yo, it's so nice to meet another black girl, you know, because she has this one close friend. And it's so nice or whatever. And I was like, yeah, it's really cool. But the thing is, we don't even talk at school. <laughs> we don't talk at school. But it's not really our fault. I mean, we could try to, you know, talk more. But it's just, we don't even have any classes together. And it's, like, understandable, you know? And I'm not trying to force anything. So I'm just letting God lead away. He lead away. You know, God take the wheel. So I'm just letting God lead away, and who knows, maybe next semester, maybe next semester, um, we'll have a class together and we'll start chatting then, and I can chat up with the other girl. Like, they're really cool, they're really, yeah, they're just cool. Okay, y'all, I feel like I'll come back once I'm in, like, the middle, because, like, I'm trying to make this video less than 15 minutes, so... Wow, I mean, this looks a lot less now because I cut it and it's been a few hours. <laughs> Why did I stop like that? But it's been a few hours and it's like 7.30 right now. And this is my hair or whatever. I feel like this side is always shorter for me and this side is always like longer so if y'all see that i don't know if y'all can tell that much but it doesn't really matter how it grows i mean how it looks because like when it's um in its natural state like you can't tell the difference so but yeah i just wanted to show y'all progress i'm in like the middle area now so i just wanted to come back on here and talk a little bit more, you know? And I don't know if I should um, show y'all how, not how, but like show y'all when it's like washed and like braided. Because I'm trying to braid it. Because what's it called? On Monday. I already talked about this. Never mind. I already talked about it. But what's another topic we could talk about? Um, I don't know if I should talk about this. I mean, it's not that deep, but, um, I feel so awkward. I hate talking about myself to, like, a bunch of people. Like, my friends, they know what I'm, what, like, what I want to talk about. But, like, y'all, 
I don't even know y'all, man. I don't even know y'all's faces. So, like, it's kind of like, I'm not trying to expose myself, but, like, whatever. It doesn't really matter. It's not that deep. But if y'all go to my school, please stop watching my videos. <laughs> please stop watching my videos because, I don't know, it just feels, oh, it just feels a little weird. I don't know, it's like y'all see the side of me that y'all never actually see at school. Like, when I'm on camera, I'm like, I talk in like my accent or whatever. I speak the way I speak. But like when I'm at school, yo, I notice that whenever I get home, I become, I start talking more and I become more louder. Because whenever I'm home, I'm in like code switch mode. I mean, whenever I'm at school, I'm in like code switch mode and I don't speak at all. So when I get home, it's like, it's like me repaying what I didn't say for eight hours. Y'all see these bags, yo? tired i am the school life senior year mess and people say that senior year should be a breeze compared to college which is, which is true but like i'm out here struggling yo but anywho uh let's talk about boys Ooh, girl chat girl talk i actually want to do one like i want to do a girl talk where y'all send me questions or like Y'all just send me think. Ugh. This video today is gonna be like my face. It's not bad. Like if y'all trying to come for me and saying that I'm always coming up with makeup and I'm insecure, I'm not, baby. This is my face. Clear, clear, clear. Um, but this hair it does not go with this. It looks a little wonky, you know. But it's okay. It's okay. Anyway, let's talk about boys. Wow. Okay, so. There's this dude, <laughs> this makes me feel so awkward. I've been talking for four minutes and I'm dragging this on. But there's this dude, right? And I ain't never talked to him. I mean, we've talked school related stuff in class for a group, like whatever. But I ain't talked to him ever. But I don't know, I just find it weird how this nigga's always staring. Like, he's always staring. And I don't know if it's because, like, in the back of me is the door and he's trying to dip. Maybe that's the case. He just want to go home. Or maybe he likes me. I don't know. I don't know. But, um, but today I switched, um, where I was sitting. And tell me what homeboy... I mean, it's kind of like in his area, see, he could still be, he could, like, if he wanted to, he could be looking outside at the door, like he usually does. But, tell me why today I was, like, not even to the door. I was all the way at the, like, end of the room. Homeboy was still eyeing me, like, baby boy, what's up? Pull up. Snapchat me. <laughs> Jokes. I mean, well... Well, let me not expose myself like that. But, like, for what? Like, I guess so, like, not even insecure, like, just weirded out. Like, do I have something in my face? Am I ugly? I know I'm not that ugly, but, like, am I ugly? <laughs> like, you're just, you just can't fathom how ugly somebody looks. Or am I that beautiful that you just can't fa fathom how beautiful I look? Like, which one is it, homie? Which one is it? Because you got me all the way stressed. Yo, I be catching this dude straight up looking at me. And I'm like, what's it for? I mean, my Snapchat is... Let me not say it because... Mm -mm. But... Who knows? I mean, he ain't looking bad either. He's not bad. Let me not expose myself a lot because some of these people might be watching and I'm not trying to expose myself like that. But at the same... Y'all, this college application system 
thing going is not going <laughs> it ain't going like it's middle of november and i still haven't sent in anything um i don't even know which one i actually want to go to i just know colleges so who knows i might not even end up going to college <laughs> i'm just playing my mama will kill me but am i allowed to say that k word <laughs> on youtube like youtube be getting crazy now it's like is your channel made for kids yes or no <laughs> can you say this and this yes or no um i feel like my youtube isn't made for like 13 and under i feel like it's not it's not made for like 13 and under but anywho what was i even talking about college i can't wait to dip I can't wait to leave this school because your girl's just going through it. I just hate that school. I hate that institution. It is not doing me justice. It is not in my favor. I don't like it. I'm kind of speaking, <laughs> like, I'm making it kind of deep, kind of deep, but, like, it's not that deep, but, like, it's kind of that deep. I don't know, like... Why do I keep saying like, like, but like, 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 the school itself, a bit problematic for me. Like, I've, I've already talked about this. Bro, like, in the YOLO thing, I got one other one, and I looked, and I, it was in, like, my notification thing, right? And then... I go on the YOLO app because I read it from my notification and I was like, hmm, what the heck? This is weird. And then I go to my note, I go to the actual app, the message isn't there. So, like, I didn't even know you could delete um, a message. But anyway, it said, do you, how often do you think about me? And I'm like, first of all, homie, homie or homegirl or whatever, like, I don't even know who you are. How am I supposed to be thinking about you if I don't even know who you are? But don't worry. I don't think about you. I really don't. I really don't. I only think about going home. My next YouTube video content. What I'm finna eat. And school. That's it. That's all I think about. Mm, I'm just playing. But like... How are you gonna send that if you're not gonna, like, put your name on it, bro? Like, how am I supposed to know? I don't think I've talked about this on here, but... Uh, for my college, the things that I actually want to do, like... If I actually have to go to college, because, like, nobody wakes up... What?! What does that even mean? I can't say what I want to do. That's How is that private? <laughs> it's not like I'm like, oh, I'm going to this school. You guys, da 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 da. Like, I'm just saying what I actually want to do. We love African parents. Ugh. Yes, but <laughs> Chad and I get insecure about talking now. Like, why'd you gotta be so damn nosy, sis? Why? But anyway, um, what I actually want to do to, like, in college and university or whatever, like, if I actually have to go to college, like, nobody wakes up and is like, I want to go spend thousands of dollars on a paper. Like, I mean, unless if you have to, you know, like, doctors, go to school. Stay in school, stay on your books. But, like, if you're just, I don't know, it just depends or whatever. I'm like, am I a YouTuber now? Like, I'm talking about dropping out of school. But, um, <laughs> um what I actually want to do is, before you enter law school, you have to have, like, an undergrad, I think. I really don't know what any of that stuff means but you have to go to college basically so i'm thinking 
political science as y'all can see on my channel a bitty likes to get political <laughs> she likes to get you know i want to know more about like the world and like how laws work how the human brain works you know like philosophy psychology all that stuff so i'm thinking political science and then political i don't know if I don't know this is what I have right now like I have no knowledge whatsoever I'm thinking political science for three four years then law school for I think maximum is four but it's usually done in like three years I think really don't know and yeah I'm thinking law school I don't know what kind of lawyer I want to be I'm thinking immigration I'm thinking immigration or y'all see Annalise Keating. She just be, she just, she's just that girl. I'm thinking, you know, like Olivia Pope. Like, she's just that girl. Was she a lawyer? Was Olivia a lawyer? I don't know what she was doing, but I just want to be her, okay? I want to be like these strong, two sh black, strong women. So, maybe that. Maybe solve some murder cases. Maybe, you know set some people of color that were wrongly convicted set them free um yeah like that's what i'm trying to do you know i'm trying to better our justice system better our world you know so yeah that's what i actually want to do i don't think you guys can see a lot can you like get out i'll look that way bro <laughs> My sister is in my room. In our room. The guy you gonna put that in? Damn, shut up! Uh -huh. Anyway, it's 10.30. It's like exactly an hour. Like last time I checked in. I have like three. These three left. And I'm almost done, bro. It's taking me, what, six hours? almost six hours bro i finally learned not learned but like i'm learning how to drive and yo can you stop staring at me anyway my mom brought me to this like park and not it, i mean it's a park but then they have parking lots so they have spaces and whatever and yo, driving, it's a weird sensation. It's like, <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but like once you're behind the wheel, I think you can understand. Like it feels so weird. It's like you're moving, you're like, you got a fate of your life in your hands, yo. Like, I don't know, it just feels so weird. I've had my L, which is like a learner's. I've had it for like, almost 60 days bro i still haven't gotten like the actual card i don't know why but i haven't and like last week was my first day like learning how to freaking drive like behind the wheel and yo it is scary it's like you gotta think of all these things ahead while you're driving you gotta look back you gotta look next to you and all that stuff and it is it is crazy but I low-key can park. Don't get me wrong. I can park. Look at all this. Like, Y'all know how everybody, you know, was obsessed with One Direction, Zayn Malik, Harry, and the irrelevant ones. <laughs> but you know how everybody was, like, obsessed with them and everything? Bro, I was obsessed with the Jake Miller. Like repping his merch and everything buying his merch listening to him 24 7 i actually got mad one time because he came to portland maine and i was like damn i really want to go but my mom was freaking working so i couldn't even go i wasn't gonna take the bus because bro it was cold as hell actually it was summertime but i was still not gonna bust it like that's too much no ma'am but I was obsessed with that nigga, bro. Like, I even started 
I even started my whole Twitter. Just, do y'all see this <laughs> dirt? <laughs> Disgusting. But I even started my Twitter solely based on the fact of going and like adding him and adding him, not adding him. I mean, I was going to follow him too, but adding him and being like, yo, I just saw you on snap because at the time he was like at, still now like I'm, I'm pretty sure he's still like a low-key like um rapper slash singer i don't even know what he calls himself now like before that he used to be like a rapper like singing inspirational whatever and now it's all about <laughs> but now it's all about just you know being with girls and whatever and it was just I was over it. I was like, you're not giving me inspirational, motivational music. Now it's all about getting that money and getting coochie. And I'm over it. I'm over it, honestly. So, now, now it's kind of like he's left behind. He's been left behind for like three years now. But he actually followed me and he liked two of my tweets. But I'm pretty sure I'm muted because this nigga never sees anything that I post. And I'm pretty sure it happens to like a lot of people. I hate when celebrities or influencers, when they're like small, they follow like their fans or whatever. And then they never like anything of their like they're posting or whatever it's like why'd you follow me if you're just gonna mute me like what was the point what was the reason bro like that's so irritating might as well take back your follow i don't want it it's useless now like damn at this point i even muted him because i was like i don't like you anymore i'm not obsessed with you like that anymore so i muted you i still get that follow but i muted you you know and now low-key i'm obsessed with the baby I, not really, because I only listened to like three songs of his, I can't really call it an obsession, but the baby slaps. I'm pretty sure I sound like every other, you know, black girl. It's like, the baby's so good, but he is, bro, like, he is so good. He is that nigga. He might be short, but we stand short kings, and that's on period, period, like, he just... Mm. And his baby mama, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And his kid, bro, cute, cute. And apparently he has, like, a third kid on the way, so good on him. And he's coming to Vancouver, so should, should I hop out? Should I pull out? <laughs> I'm just playing... I'm too broke for that. Plus, if I'm gonna go to a concert, I might as well make it that I can actually see him. I don't wanna be all the way in the back, you know, rapping, and he ain't even gonna see me, you know? So, if I really wanna go see, I gotta get money, and I don't got that, so. <laughs> Y'all, this is my hair. This is my hair. These girls in class, they were talking about, oh my, God, oh my God, my hair is curly. Like, it's so, like, it's tight curls. And I was like, I didn't say anything. Like, I was like, I don't foresee that with your hair. Because these are the tightest curls of my life, of the entire world. Like, foresees the tightest curls. We know this. Like, babes but anywho i feel like the lighting is just too harsh but ooh, let me make it into an afro like an even afro yo one time i actually went to school like this with like a big afro and tell me why these girls could not stop talking about me why are you staring you've never seen negroes before Actually, they've never. The thing is, now that I think about it, they've never seen Negroes before. Because the school, predominantly Indian. Negroes don't exist. <laughs> like, we one person out here, okay? But 
they just kept staring. They would not like I would I was walking, you know, my head held high. I was like, I'm that B. <laughs> Look at this crown on my head. You can never and that's on period. And they just would stare, like and then one time I was in class and these girls they were sitting together and then she was and they looked at me, they both looked at me and then they're like sh -sh -sh -sh. Like, what you gotta say? You ain't gonna be bold enough to say it to my faces. I know you ain't. I know you ain't. You a punk asshole. That's what you are. Period. And I looked at them, and they looked like scared. And I was like, girl, I knew you would never be that bold. You just wouldn't. And since that day, I haven't went with my afro out. Cause that niggas felt made me weird. Like, oh my god. Yeah. This is how my hair is. It's in a stretch state. I really like I really like my hair in a stretch state. That's why you can see its length. But shrinkage is a stupid hoe. And she won't let me live. And she really won't let me live. So I'm gonna enjoy this just for the night and then I'm gonna wash my hair in the morning. I might show y'all, show y'all how I braid it because I'm trying to braid it and then do like a braid out or like a twist out for my pictures. So y'all finna see. Okay, so next day it's like 1.40 right now. I'm about to wash my hair. This is how my hair looks like. Watch it shrink times two. Like y'all finna be surprised. Bro, I'm using this shampoo then i'm using this conditioner but i use another conditioner after this i just use this because when i'm in the shower i just comb it out and it's easier so i use two shampoos what did i tell y'all look at this y'all see this now it's kind of like dry there's still some like water in it but shrinkage does not want to see me winning she's a hater like why would you do this to me bro y'all this is my hair now i just combed it i used um i used this thing the cantu shea butter leave-in conditioner that's literally all that i put that's why my curls aren't defined it's just like combed out it's not defined or anything i don't really do anything I don't even add moisturizer. Oop. I don't even add moisturizer. That's why my hair doesn't grow up fast, but I'm just lazy to buy other things. Plus, I don't know what works for my hair, and I'm not trying to spend money on products that is not gonna work. So I just use the stuff that I know will work, and this is what I always get. And it's like, what time is it? It's like 3.20 right now. I still haven't like done any twist or braid out. But I'm about to go dry for my second time. And then when I come back, I'm going to do like twist outs or like a braid out. And I'm going to show you all how it looks like. I told y'all I was going to show you how it looks like. I decided to do a braid out instead. I need section and probably I just section however and then I just braid it out. And then I'm going to take out my hair. On Monday and I think I'll show you guys how it looks like so yeah okay guys so this is the blue not the blue out the um, braid out this is how it looks like I just took my grad pictures and this is how it looks like if you guys enjoyed my video please make sure you give it a thumbs up comment down below if you like something make sure you subscribe because i'm trying to hit 500 subscribers before the end of the year so it'll be great if you just subscribe you know um and i think that's it i'll see you guys next time hopefully bye